Sri Lankans are big cricket fans. I got some very good news. KFC T20 Big Bash League will be held on the 7th of December here in Melbourne. To talk about that event, it's with great pleasure I'd like to introduce Mr. Simon Helmut, who is going to talk about uh, about the Big Bash. Good morning and welcome to our program. Thanks very much, Derek. Thanks for having me. Uh, Simon, first of all, what is Big Bash is all about? We're into the second year of the uh, of the KFC Big Bash. Uh, last year, uh, obviously, was uh, the start of this massive competition where the whole world stops and watches uh, Australian cricket, Australian domestic cricket, uh, with lots of international players uh, being involved. Uh, the Big Bash is obviously a, a, a T20 tournament which... Uh, goes over six weeks uh, over the December January period and uh, it's quite a long time it is a long time <laughs> okay. and the uh, Melbourne Renegades are looking for an improved performance on, on last year unfortunately we finished seventh uh, out of the eight teams yeah. this year we're aiming to be number one now to get number one who are the international players have you invited uh, well we're very uh, pleased and excited that uh, and so should the Sri Lankan community that we have uh, Maruli uh, oh coming gosh. over and, okay. and playing for us so yeah, yeah like I said we're one of the great players yeah. Yeah, one of the greatest players ever obviously the uh, the leading uh, ever wicket taker in test match cricket yeah. uh, a formidable uh, player in the shortened versions of the game and uh, he's currently playing in the Sri Lankan Sri Lankan Premier League at the moment yeah, that's and right, yeah. uh, look we're really pleased that Maruli is going to be playing for the Melbourne Renegades based out at Etihad Stadium this year and hopefully he's going to help us now assault to become the number one uh, Big Bash team here in Australia. Okay. Now you've been the coach. Uh, who are the other players who's, who are recognised players for the Melbourne Renegades? Yeah, for sure. M many of your viewers would know Aaron Finch. Yes. Uh, he's obviously one of the uh, the great T20 talents for uh, for the Melbourne Renegades and, uh, and has played for Australia. We're lucky to have the services of Dan Harris uh, and our own uh, rough and ready uh, Jade Herrick. Uh, with uh, a current Australian A member, Tom Cooper. So we believe we've got a good blend of uh, experienced players as well as some youth. Okay. <clears throat> now talking about teams, who are the other teams involved? Yeah, there's two teams out, based out of Sydney. Yeah. Uh, I won't give you their names. Two yeah. teams in Sydney, yeah. uh, one in Tasmania, one in South Australia, Queensland and Western Australia. Yeah. Two here in, uh, in Victoria, but the only one to follow is the Melbourne Renegades. Okay. Uh, now, talking about what can our viewers expect uh, in, for this big bash? What are the uh, are the is there any other entertainment as such? Oh, absolutely! And as we know, the Sri Lankan community are passionate about about their cricket, and yeah. uh, Etihad Stadium is going to provide a fantastic environment for exciting uh, cricket. Lots of sixes, lots of fours, yeah. lots of wickets. But it's yeah. also about getting the crowd involved. In and uh, we're looking very much to have a, a, the Papara uh, band uh, involved. Yeah. Um, we'll have the, the short eats. Uh, we'll yeah. have dedicated areas for our Sri Lankan community to, to yeah. really get involved and be passionate. Yeah. Follow one of the greatest ever uh, uh, T20 bowlers, one day bowlers in right. in, uh, in Murali, yeah. uh And certainly support uh, Aaron Finch and the team in making sure that we have a, a really good feel uh, on it in our home games. We play four home games, and Derek, as you stated, our first match is uh, on Friday, the 7th of December, Seven, yeah. against our crosstown rivals, the Melbourne Stars. They have worn, we have Murley. Oh my god. So gosh, we're looking yeah. forward to packing out the house, closing the roof yeah. if we need to, and yeah. having a fantastic cricket match. And yeah. hopefully the uh, Melbourne Renegades can reverse the trend from, from last, uh, last year's derby. Yeah. I'm sure, Simon, you're going to get a very big crowd, especially having two great uh, players like Murali and, and Shane Bourne. You know, I mean, people will love to see them uh, against each other. Look, I think last year the, the more mature or experienced spin bowler in Brad Hogg yeah. and Stuart McGill and Shane himself all did very well. So we're very yeah. pleased now that we're able to provide one of the greatest spinners ever in Murali to come over and be yeah. involved. And Derek, I must say, I caught up with Murali a few weeks ago. I was actually over in Sri Lanka oh, okay. uh, with, a, with an Australian um, a small group who were yeah. developing their T20 skills and had a chance to, to catch up with Murali and talk all things cricket. And he's very yeah. excited to be able to come over here. He's always wanted to come and play yeah. in the domestic uh, competition in the Big yeah. Bash. Yeah. So we're pleased that the Melbourne Renegades have found him a nice spot. He definitely wanted to come to Melbourne. Yeah. Obviously, has lots of friends and family and people he knows. Yeah. In, uh, and Melbourne has such a strong uh, Sri Lankan community. So uh, we're, he's very much looking forward to coming over in December. We hope as many of the fans can come over and see him see him do his best work. Likewise, because uh, as you know, he's a big draw card. 
and uh, also the uh, team they are playing against Shane Vaughan and uh, I'm sure you know there'll be many many Sri Lankans who will support and uh, will you be able to briefly tell us now you told me it runs for nearly two months yes how, how does that all work? Derek, there's eight teams all together. Okay. Everyone plays each other uh, once, except we play the derby twice. So there'll be two matches where one game at Etihad Stadium yeah. where, where we play the Melbourne Stars, Warren v. Morley, and also one, one game against them at the MCG in round eight. So we have eight rounds. If you finish in the top half of, of, uh, of the competition, there'll be finals and then semi-finals and then, and then ultimately uh, a grand final. And that's what we, we aim to get into. It starts on... Uh, December the 7th, we are actually the first match of the competition and the final will be held on January the 19th. So a lot of games of cricket are being played yeah. uh, in, a, in a small amount of time, but uh, obviously the, the carrot or the, the excitement for a team to actually be successful and get into the grand final, they've been qualified for the Champions League, mm -hmm. which I think next season is going to be played in South Africa. Okay. <clears throat> now you gave us all these dates. For more information for our viewers, have you got a website as such they can sort of follow it through? Yes, of course. If uh, if people wanted to find out more about the Mel Melbourne Renegades, you'd simply go to melbournerenegades.com.au on our website. You can follow us on Twitter and on Facebook and all those new age types of things, Derek, okay. that people find it information from. Yeah, sure. But uh, for us, it's about making sure that we... We work well with the community, making sure that we're developing good relationships. The yeah. game doesn't start for another few months, so yeah, there's plenty right. of time for people yeah. to get more understanding, have a look to see some of the other players. I will say, Derek, we do have the opportunity for another overseas player to, to be in the, in the Melbourne Renegades okay. squad. So be on the lookout for that too to see who the, uh, who the next person is going to, okay. going to be with the Melbourne Renegades. In regards to membership, for an adult, it's $70 for five matches. For children under 15, it's $20 for five matches. And I'm sure there's some packages there where you can have a look on our website to find out what the best deal is for families. That's very reasonably priced, Simon, for five matches, $70. Very well priced. No, it certainly is. And we try and make it as inexpensive as possible yeah. for our fans to ensure that they can enjoy it, come with the families. Last year's show, there was lots of lots of the uh, females and children wanting to come to the games as well as the dads and the brothers and the uncles yeah uh, so it's very much uh, you know a non-traditional game yeah playing at a non-traditional venue the melbourne That's renegades right. at etihad stadium yeah. so we're looking for as as many people to come down and enjoy not only the great cricket yeah. but also also the fantastic experience experience yeah especially as i said before seeing two great players in the world mm. and let me wish you all the very best simon and uh, if there's any other information you want to tell us no, but all I can say to your viewers out there, we, we love the, the subcontinental uh, support and we're looking forward to seeing you on Friday the 7th of December uh, with the Melbourne Renegades. And Derek, we hope we see you down there. We might even try and get your Melbourne Renegades top. Oh, that'd be good, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Sam. Thank you.